The hearing kicked off about 15 minutes ago. The witnesses today include CEOs from the seven largest consumer-facing banks, J.P. Morgan's Jamie Dimon, Bank of America's Brian Moynihan, Citigroup's Jane Frazier, and Wells Fargo's Charlie Scharf, among those who are expected to be grilled by Congress on a whole host of issues today. As they were entering, our producer Mary Catherine Wellens caught up with Dimon to get his thoughts on the state of the economy. You know what it is. There are a lot of pluses and minuses out there. So, What are you hoping to see from the Federal Reserve today? Whatever they do is fine with us. Really? Yes. Are you concerned about inflation and what you're seeing from your customer yeah. base? Yes, of course. But they're taking proper action at this point, which is the right thing for them to do. And mm -hmm. we'll get through it. The hearing began with Chairwoman Maxine Waters, who spoke about how the nation's largest banks got bigger during the pandemic due to acquisitions and how executive compensation has gone higher. Then ranking member Patrick McHenry said he disagreed with the premise of this hearing altogether, calling it theater, not oversight. The committee convened this group to discuss consumer-related topics, things like overdraft fees, emerging technologies like crypto and Zelle, and privacy protection. But it's likely that during the Q&A portion, lawmakers will venture into other areas, including the increasingly politicized world of ESG, the state of the economy, and the financial regulatory environment. Currently, the executives are sharing their testimony, which we received yesterday, uh, which kind of covers most of those issues. So we're really looking forward to that Q&A portion, guys. Yeah, I wonder if they're going to ask it all if uh, they agree with the Fed policy. Yep. You know, as you point out, it can go in a lot of different directions. Um, interesting comments there from Jamie, seemingly uh, positive, at mm -hmm. least in terms of the Fed. Yeah, I think they will definitely delve into some of the more macro issues, just given the state of inflation, given what banks have been doing with regard to keeping uh, what they pay depositors, the rate that they pay depositors relatively low, considering how high rates have gone, and what they're doing with regard to loan making, things like mortgages, how they're looking at the state of the economy with regard to just all of the various macro factors that are out there. I, I think both the CEOs talking to sources close to them and then talking to sources close to the lawmakers are expecting uh, some pretty big picture conversations today as well. Leslie, thank you. Mm -hmm. Leslie Picker. Shepard Smith here. Thanks for watching CNBC on YouTube.